you guys blast here with a really quick tutorial on how to do the transition I use in the DBZ edit. So here's what it looks like. So it's gonna be where screen search like shading. Like right there. And you can see like it starts like shaking like in different directions. And this one's really easy, but you just need the uh, effect switch, which you can easily just like look up on YouTube how to get for free. So just drag it onto your clip, and then you can press and go down to your effects and turn speed down to zero. So you, whenever you want. Just go to wherever you want the like the transition to start. So just click the little stopwatch next to speed and drag it about two seconds forward and change the speed to about 25. And go to enable and turn blur on and slide on. You can use whatever you want, but that's just what I use. So just so if you just go to the clip, you can see because it starts shaking like a lot and then just go to the part of the kill cam where you want it to start it's kind of hard to see so and then go to right here so I'm just, I'm just gonna select the clip by pressing control shift d on the keyboard oh i can't do that i know um layer Uh, Alright, so I'm just gonna go there. And then go up here and then press Ctrl D to duplicate the effect and Ctrl X to cut it. And then I'm going to paste it on this clip. Press E. So I'm gonna have the speed be at 25 um, at the beginning of the clip. And then have it be down here at zero. So if you go through it should look like oh I shouldn't have all this stuff in here. Clip cut this part out too. So I'm gonna drag these two together and then So I'll just make a brand new keyframe. So I can just close the stopwatch and go put two seconds forward and change the speed to zero. So if we go to this clip, I'm gonna preview it. should start to blur a lot and then once blurring it should like turn the shipping smoothly so that's how you do the shaking transition I guess that's how you call it so just leave a like and a comment thanks for